Guys, for cheap and reliable coins, check out MuleFactory.com and use the code OWENFIFA at checkout for a discount. You can see, guys, they have loads of different coins up. Obviously, the prices will change as the game comes out more. It's cheap, fast, reliable. They do comfort trade, 100% legit, straight to your account for the cheapest price on the whole internet. Guys, I have started a free Discord. The link is down below in the description. Please do click and join the Discord. There'll be lots of different trading tips, stuff like that, in the actual um, Discord itself. But also, guys, I have started a Patreon. You can feel free to join at any level you like. See how it is. Um, you can make lots of different coins. I'll give extra tips, basically, you know, up to the gold tier where I'll trade in your account for you and make you lots of coins. I'll be expecting you guys to make probably 1 million, 2 million per week with this. So, obviously, it's a very good value thing. So, yeah, I hope you do enjoy, guys, and I will see you all very soon in the video. Hey guys, what's going on today? Welcome to a brand new video guys. It's going to be an insane filter that I'm going to show you here. It's something that I've been doing on the Xbox a little bit. I'm not always a massive person for sniping. Like, I always like a bit of bidding and like a bit of tactical buy now and stuff like that. I'm not always a fan of it, but I really did find this filter and it's very, very good. So we're going to get started here. You want to go into here and put in gold red. That doesn't really matter, but I always like putting it in. You want to go to Germany next and then the Barclays Premier League. And you can probably guess which team, Chelsea. You can see here now under this filter they have Timo Werner... Kai Havertz and Rudiger somewhere, there he is. So obviously you can select all three of these players. The regular one's obviously going to be Kai Havertz realistically, like don't get it like twisted, it's not going to be some insane filter where 10,000 Werners pop up at ridiculous prices. We can see here Kai Havertz 5.8k, you're going to go to about 5.2 here and just snipe them all because the thing is they do come up, there's a lot of them that come up. Um, at certain times in the day, like during the week, like the 6 p.m., stuff like that. This method will be beautiful, guys, tonight for the one to watches that are coming out. I won't be on, unfortunately, but I hope you guys make loads of coins during ones to watch. Um, I'll try and be active in my Discord, guys. Go and check that out if you're not in there already. Uh, we've got about 60 people in there now, so it's getting pretty busy, which is what I love to see. Let's try and get it up to 100. That'd be perfect. See here, Havertz so 4.9. This is a problem. People are like using bots and stuff on Havertz, so sometimes it's going to be difficult to get them. And not only that, obviously, people will be sniping this filter already. I'm guessing people already know this. Um, like It's a pretty simple filter for three players. Like There's not many filters where you can do this sort of thing, so... I do imagine there'll be a lot of people doing it, but um, it's definitely one to check out. I'm going to show you another filter, guys, later on as well, so don't worry about that. There's going to be two in this video, so make sure you check the other out. Rudy for 5k, that is a perfect example. This guy is about 7.2k, so that'd be 2k on this one card there straight away. Obviously, Werner is the mad one. Like, if you pick Werner up, it's GG. You've made it, like, probably 20k. Um, it's very, like, rare he comes up, but he does come up. I've seen two screenshots before on this like method where people have missed the Werner for like 4k, something like that. So obviously make sure you keep looking. Obviously there's loads of words we made, like 20k in literally like 2 minutes if you're lucky. Like 50k in 5 minutes if you get a couple of Werners up. You never know, like there's always, and the, the titles guys, obviously they might sound like clickbait, but it's always the best potential outcome. It's not like... I like, obviously I could sit here now for an hour and get nothing. It's the best potential outcome of what could happen realistically. Like very easily two winners could get listed, you know what I mean? Like it takes two idiots out of packs, something like that, and they do come up. So don't like the dishearten by the titles, it's pretty it goes on everywhere. If I put a title as like make one K in ten minutes, I'd have about three views and there'd be no point uploading it. You have to understand that from my point. I'm sorry if it does sound a bit misleading. I don't intentionally be misleading, but I do have like seven and a half mil on PlayStation. I'm not lying to you guys like I do know how to trade and I can promise you that you can see here it's gone a bit quiet so what I do is when it's quiet I just double check the price first of all so I see here now it's about 5.8 like yeah so I'm going to put in here now 5.2k and I'm going to go and bid on all the howitzers that are there but you have to understand you would be looking at like what the hell you don't want to do that you want to ignore that totally and go to Kai Havertz and click on him because there'll be loads of bids here that are there but they just don't show them like look you can see here straight away it's a massive glitch on this game at the moment that you need to be aware of. You don't want to be bidding through that like filter. You want to go through the player on compare price and bid on them all. So just do that and then go back to sniping. Because you might win 1 out of 20. You might win none. It's just one of them things, basically. And there is one other way to do this. It's another way. It's totally up to you. But you put in centre mid and you look at how it's again here. It's about 6.4k, I believe. 6.5k. Okay, 6'6 six, six now, he's risen even more, which is crazy. So let's say 6'7 in there. You want to just search like this, you want to keep searching. And they do come up for the like, normal price in a camp, like the, the camp price, but put into centre mid. Which is always worth checking, like it's always worth looking for them. 
Or to go even further to this, you can put in striker look and check the striker price GG and the CDM price GG. So then what you want to do is you want to put in cam and put in about 6k and then just go all the way to the 59th minute and hope there's not many past the hour. But unfortunately here there's loads, you want to go 5.9. This is another way to do this with habits. It's a nice little way to try and get any conversions. So any that come up for 5.9 and either a centre mid, CDM or striker can be very nice profit. Obviously some of them, they aren't massive profits, but again, it's not all about the massive profit. You can also obviously snipe the 5.4s if you get them. That was very slow by me. Um, but yeah, you can kind of see like, the gist of what's going on here. Just keep looking. There. If you see a 5.2 or anything like that, go and snipe it in any position. But obviously the occasional centre mid, it's not like every minute. But it's always a way to snipe habits. I've really enjoyed doing this in the past. Um, it is a nice little way to make some extra coins if you're obviously different. Like in this sort of way. It's very hard to get these deals in because if you look at the time, it's 9.54am. The rewards have just dropped but everyone's on trading, like sweating it out. I've got no choice but to make the videos now because I am... That's probably not a... I mean, it's 5.8. Whatever. Like, it'll sell, but it wasn't insane. Uh, it's probably like 100 coins profit. <laughs> I don't know why I bought that. I just, well, I mean, it's a bit of profit. It's not really ideal. They don't go and buy that if you only have like 10k. Ignore what I just did there. That was stupid. But uh, yeah, just keep searching like this, obviously, and hopefully try and find something. If not, you can always check through the positions again. I'm going to end it there, guys. That's pretty simple of what we do. I mean, there's not really much else to say. But I hope you have enjoyed this video. If you have, please do drop a like and sub if you're new. Good luck to all you guys that will be watching um, streams later on. And get ready for ones to watch. I hope you do pack something good if you do open any packs for ones to watch. I.e. I, any like special packs you have saved. Anything like that. Good luck. Let me know down below if you do try this method, if you do get any deals. I'm just going to finally end this here now with listing up the habits that we got. Just to show you guys that I'm not like bullshitting or anything. We'll just list it up here. And I'm going to go show you guys the bids of habits and what they go for. Just to show you that mass bidding can be good and it can be bad. So hopefully it will give a perfect example here of the prices. Let's have a look. So yeah, look, five, wow, I'm so stupid. 5-3 in a centre mid and 5-3 in a cam. They're both in a salon for 5-8. That guy just made 250 coins and a K there. So GG to whoever that was. I was stupid and didn't check them. That's a perfect example of the bidding feature, especially on Xbox. It's very, very useful on Xbox. But yeah, guys, thanks for watching, and I will see you all.